With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, question is given here. The coefficient of friction between a block a of the mass m1 is 5 kg and the block b of the mass m2 is equal to 10 kg is mu to 0.25. Okay. So coefficient of friction here mu2 is given how much 0.5 okay now see there is no friction force between block b and the fixed horizontal surface okay means here this is a smooth surface a smooth surface so here mu is equal to 0 no frictional force is here okay now see a force of 300 newton x on a block b 300 newtons on a block B horizontal direction and a horizontal force of magnitude F X on a block A and F force is acting on the block A okay as shown both towards right initially there is no relative motion between the block then the minimum value of F such that relative motion at start between A and B so we have to find how much minimum force we apply here on block A so relative motion at start okay so see first we will check if force is 0 minimum force means f f is equal to 0 if we apply f force 0 means uh, here no relative motion okay so let's assume if f is apply here so no relative motion this block will be in rest okay so if we assume at a and b as a system a plus b that is equal to m1 plus m2 is equal to system okay let's assume this is our system okay so here net force is how much here 300 is equal to mass is how much m1 plus m2 into acceleration a okay so here 300 is equal to m1 plus m2 is how much 10 plus 5 into acceleration a so from here acceleration a is equal to 20 meter per second square okay so acceleration of this uh, if we assume here m1 m2 as a system so acceleration will be how much 20 meter per second square okay so see uh, for the relative uh, motion here this m into a that is equal to 20 meter per second square if greater than mu into mu into mg okay so if this will this value will be greater so relative motion will be done if f if we apply this f is equal to 0 so here m and m cancel okay so this 20 greater than mu into g so now we calculate mu g so mu into g is equal to how much mu value is to 0.5 given into g value is 10 that is equal to how much 5 okay so from here see here 20 is greater than 5 okay so here already relative motion exists okay already already relative motion exists okay okay at f minimum is equal to 0 okay so force minimum will be how much zero so c option fourth is the correct option thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today